Another way to examine variability in Six Sigma is using multivariate charts. And you can see they show a lot of different things here. So in the QI macros, it's pretty straightforward to draw one of these charts. Simply, you can see here we have size of customer, product type, customer type, overall satisfaction. Well, maybe I want to find out more about uh, those things. So literally, I can come down here and select all of this data with my mouse. And we have about 100 data points. And then I'm going to choose manufacturer and customer type and overall satisfaction. And what I want to know is, uh, you know, we have large and small customers. We have different types of product types. Some are for consumers, some for manufacturers, and different types of customer within there. I'd like to know something more about variability among all of these people and their overall satisfaction. So in the QI macros, I click on multivariate chart. It'll go out and start summarizing all these things by the various groups here. And it'll draw a plot here. And so here you can see large consumer one. Uh, here's all of our points and the variability. Uh, here's the average of all three of these across this way. And then this is a link of all the averages in each one of these two, three bars here. And it shows it by large consumers and then large manufacturers, small consumers, and small manufacturers and showing us our standard deviation down here, which also shows that there's not a lot of variation. Now, this starts to give us some sort of insight into large manufacturers and, and, large, uh, and large consumers. Um, they're kind of all over the map in terms of overall satisfaction. They're probably our lowest uh, response here. And small manufacturer, there's quite a bit of variability and some low ones out there as well. But this, this starts to give us a picture of where we are. You can see across the board they're all about the same. But we can also see where there's some people think we're better, large consumer two. And, uh, you know, those twos in the middle seem to do better than the, the ones on either end. So this is a way to start to analyze variability when you have multiple things that you're trying to compare across, uh, you know, various different customer segments or whatever. And so that's how we draw the multivariate chart. And you can see from all of this that, again, this is just another way to show all of the various uh, variation and variability in our customers and in our products and in whatever it is that we're producing and how they respond to them. And this might be an, an interesting way to start to do some analysis on all of those things. And you can draw them easily in the QI Macros. And you can download a 30-day trial from QIMacros.com.